There's a heat mat on the top of here, so you don't want to put anything up on top of the fridge. It'll melt and then light on fire. There's an open flame at the back of this fridge, so you don't want to take stuff like brooms or bags or cardboard and put it next to the open flame. There's nothing around the propane fridge. There's one single vent in the center of this freezer. That's the only way for the cold air to fall from the freezer down to the fridge. So if that gets plugged up with a Ziploc bag, you won't get any cooling to your fridge. To light it, it's a two-man operation. One guy holds the primer, one guy lights it in the back by hand. The button on the right is the primer. You have to hold it in, and then it has to be vertical in the direction of the flame. If you turn this horizontal to where it says off, it shuts the propane off. This is your climate control. Clockwise is colder. All the way maximum clockwise, there's a stopper, so you can't just keep spinning and spinning. Uh, usually, it stays at about two and a half or three. If it's not cold enough, you turn it up clockwise. If it's too cold, uh, down counterclockwise. If the food in the fridge starts freezing, maybe down to two and a half. This is a sparker on this side. Uh, usually they don't work, so they're removed. So you light it in the back by hand. And the burner is right in the bottom corner, right below this heat vent. 